Welcome back to Prey. I was taking a look at the Danielle's treasure map thing, and guess what? I know what to do. Well, sort of. At least I know what I'm looking for. So it turns out, it is indeed a case of you need to find this, what this map depicts on the station, and you need to look here, where this little eye is, for the number. I found this one right here in the uh, Crew Quarters Recreation Center itself. So. Let's look here. So we have stairs that go up, we have a room to the left, at the top left, and then we have a bigger room over here with like two doors that lead into it. I realized this kind of looks like the top floor of the wreck. This goes up, this is the yellow tulip, and well, we can just go look. Go upstairs, there's a room right over there, kind of double doors sort of to get in. And then I thought, okay, well, if all that's true, then the number should be right up here. And look at that. Well, you can't see it because it's totally whited out because the flashlight's too bright. Six. Oh, wow. It actually updates the quest. So there you have it. Now, let me just go try to find the rest. A call? Directors is caught wind of the situation here. I suppose it was inevitable despite my efforts. That's why it's important we act quickly, decisively. They'll try to take this out of our hands, Morgan. Alex, I'm busy with a treasure hunt. Come on. Okay, I definitely found another one. Oh, looks like we got some enemies in there. Oh! Looks like they saw me. Anyway, so my tactic has been to go to each place, um, because we can look at the station map, but we can't actually, as far as I can tell, we can't actually look at the maps of these places, like inside of them. You can just see that they exist and what they connect to, but you can't actually look at the maps of the places themselves unless you're in them. So I've been going to each one like this. This is, this whole section is life support. And thankfully you can flip through the levels, so you can just go anywhere in life support and then flip through all the levels and look for a match. And what does this look like? Yeah, that is definitely the robot face, like undoubtedly. Water treatment facility. I feel like I heard it. I feel like I heard another one a second ago. Anyway, so I actually took pictures of the maps on my phone because it was really annoying to try to search through my notes. So, looking at it right now, according to the map, the number should be right here. Like, it shows the eyeball here, looking in this direction. So it should be like here. Oh, what do you know? Haha! -ha! Still don't know what order they're supposed to be in. Aha! Huh. I definitely just found another. So we're in the um, cargo bay right now. And this area right here, looking at my map for L1, there should be a number right here. 
Man, there is. Can I get it from here? Damn, not close enough. Too close. <laughs> Alright, one more to go. Aha, yep. I actually suspected it was this. I remember this bridge that's broken in the center and the way it kind of snakes around. And I thought this might be it, but I checked a couple other places first because for this one I kind of had to go into the guts to get here. Into the, uh, uh, what is this? Shuttle bay or something? Anyway, the number should be here. Uh, wait, where are we? Here. Here? Maybe it's down below. It must be down below. Definitely, like, this is definitely the place. I'm 100% sure. It shows it is, like, right here. It's back up. Oh, can't make it. Ah, there you are. Okay, that's all the numbers. I'm still not sure what order they're supposed to be in, but, um, let's go put them in. Alright, so let's hope that the order of the numbers just <laughs> just doesn't matter. Or perhaps it's already put them in the correct order, I don't know. One, two, uh, sorry, one, three, five, six. Okay. The order does matter. Alright, going with the idea that this is sort of the key for how they're supposed to be entered, I'm assuming EL is L1 and L2. I don't know why it would say EL, other than a phonetic spelling of L. So I'm going to assume this is L1 and L2. This is a dash indicating that this treasure map goes into the dash. Melindris, in other words, is the third number. And then B is the last one. So based on that, based on that, I worked it out. It should be Rosalind, Stabfellow, Melindra, Horde, and Baffel. Rosalind, Stabfellow. So... Rosalind, Stabfellow, Melindra, Horde, and Baffle. So five, six, one, three. Shit. I don't get it. I mean, there's not that many combinations of four digits. I could just brute force it. Aha! There we go. So all, <laughs> all I did is I searched the internet for show me all permutations of one, three, six, five. Or 1356. And uh, yeah, there's I think 24 combinations. And I just started entering them. Pretty sure that's not what you're supposed to do, but eh, whatever. What's my sweet, sweet loot? So, um. What was my sweet loot? Ah, alright. So I don't know if it just told me and I missed it. But, um. I just, I just googled what the quest gives you to find out exactly what it gave me, and it gave me something very cool. It gave me a fabrication plan, apparently. God, please. Can I hack you? Uh, please be quiet, thank you. So it gave us the Adventurer's Toolkit. Chipset crafted by Abigail Foy as a reward for those engaging in her treasure hunt. I think that, yeah, that's a chipset. Uh, inventory. Okay, what can I toss? Um, etheric shielding, sure. Your game master is proud of you. As a reward, you get the following. Increased recycler yield, increased wrench critical hit chance, a more efficient flashlight, and crawl through tight spaces more quickly. Everything you need for a successful dungeon excursion. That is pretty sweet. So, flashlight should last longer. Let's see. 
Oh, that definitely lasts longer. It's barely lost any power. Apparently my crouch is faster. Can't really tell. Better recycler yield? Sweet. I'm glad I did that. Alright, well I think I've cleaned up the side quests pretty nicely. Well, except for the smuggling ring thing, still got one left somewhere. Let's go back on the main quest. Let's go scan the coral. Alright, coral should be somewhere on the exterior. Microgravity detected. I've been thinking about the video Alex showed you. Your brother believes that version of you is the true Morgan, but why? Just because it came first? If someone had made you, then I suppose your truest self would be the one that fulfills whatever purpose your maker intended. I know who made me, and why. Did someone make you, Morgan? Were you made for something? If not, you'll have to invent your own purpose, or have none at all. Strangely, of all the things I know about you, I don't know what you believe. You have to decide, Morgan. Who are you? Don't know what that was. I'm just going to keep going. Wait, what the hell are those? Oh. They look strange from afar. They're just robots. Nodes? They're pretty deep in here. Aha! Oh, crap. I think I need to scan this with my psychoscope. Or not. I mean, I know I installed the scanner in my psychoscope. Are they going for the robot? Ah, uh, maybe not. Looks like they were. No, oh, why don't you go explode by that thing over there, the weaver. I think I'm out of range or something. Ah. Got one. So this seems to be the special one. Scan complete. More specimens required. Fascinating. It's holding the psyche of all their victims. Your hunch was on the right track. It's a kind of neural structure. 
Synaptic like activity up and down the length of it, like it's communicating. Just one more to go. I knew you could handle this. Our father warned me not to stake so much of the company's future on your ideas. I was right to ignore him. We're a good team, Morgan. Christ, looks like an organ. Looks like something that's beating. Let's see if I can get him to go for a recycler charge. <laughs> where, did, where did the materials go though? Oh, Either disappeared or went flying so fast I couldn't see him. Nothing that interferes with memory formation. Search complete. Excellent work. All that's left is integrating the data after you upload it. Hard to tell from just a scan summary, but... Wait. What is... There's some kind of neural trip wire built into the coral. Mm -hmm. Christ. Morgan, get back to my office. We have to get your data uploaded now. Hurry. I'm intrigued. Neural tripwire. What's this? This isn't where I came in. Oh. That wouldn't happen to be Josh Dalton, would it? Ah, it's not. How strange, though. They have nothing on them. But they seem important, right? I mean, they're wearing, like, a special thing. I feel like maybe there's going to be a quest for them later or something. I don't know. Or maybe they're mentioned in some log and it's kind of a story kind of thing. Oh, it's actually accessible from the outside. Hmm. Alright, let's head back. Let's get back to the Arboretum. Here's my terminal to upload the data. Uh... I'll get it integrated into the fabrication plan for the new Null Wave device as fast as possible. And be careful. The Typhoon will begin to sense our intent to harm the Coral. They're gonna come after you. I left something for you on my desk that should help. I saw that visual error before, I think, when I was searching for the smuggling drop-off points. I guess it's a recurring problem. Operator approach. has authorized me to take full command of Talos-1, effective immediately. All employees must now report to the shuttle bay for evacuation. Those of you unable to comply, transmit an SOS and my team of rescue operators will locate you. One last thing. 
Alex and Morgan Yu have been relieved of their positions. Do not consent to their requests or assist them in any way. Dal out. Holy crap, they have lasers. Holy crap, they're strong. Can I hack them? No, I can't hack them. Crap. Hiding until Dahl and his tech officers are disabled. I just wanted to do that. Morgan, Dahl will know you're coming. All Transtar personnel are outfitted with tracking bracelets. I have no doubt his operators are already on their way to rescue you. Those bracelets are issued and removed in deep storage. Ah, right. Worth investigating if you want to fly under the radar. Ah, I can disable my own dragging bracelet. I probably should have done that before. Well, let's go there right- oh, hey. Hello? Probably should repair my suit. And have a little nibble. Christ, there's a lot of them. It might be time to start zapping them. I have upgraded this thing, right? Oh, and I've got a couple more upgrades. Let me see if I can upgrade it more. Ah, oh, yeah. Let's get this to max. Range would be good. Shots would be good. I'll go with range first. Well, wow. couldn't even reach that. Where's the other one? Where'd it fall? I don't see it. Uh oh. Inspecting. Your suit suffered some wear and tear. Ah, that's the bridge. Deep storage over here. Yep, deep storage. See ya. It's probably gonna come down here with me, right? I'm just gonna run in here. Resuming. Uh oh. Morgan, I heard the announcement. No, no, 
I will not give you up. You are there for me. I am here for you. If you indulge me, I have a proposal that will be Okay, oh, just hold on a sec. Just don't harm Darwin until we have a chance to speak in person. A little bit busy, but I think I caught that. What is that doing? Oh god. Oh, oh shit. Are all those stations being used to make those things that are gonna hurt me? Oh Christ. Maybe? Oh. I can't hack it back. It's already been hacked. I can't rehack it. What the hell was I saying? Uh. I barely remember. Oh yeah, Igwe. What did they say? Talk with me first before doing anything with Doll? Capacitate Doll. Meet Igwe at your office. Okay. Uh, Igwe wants to meet in my office before I confront Doll so we can propose an idea. Alright. Oh god, it's just gonna keep requesting operators. Shit. We're all liabilities to the company now. Doll. I'm sure you can hear me. You don't know what my... What the board told you. But you're out of your depth on this one. Call off your operators. Or at least have this hold back your time. We're on the verge of the Your brother. He likes a microphone. What the what the hell is Walter Dahl? A freaking space pirate? Look at him. A smoke right. He can't resist. Even though he's hiding. And you are running around like a nervous rat. I hear you, chewing the wires and shitting in the walls. Are you trying to fix the mess you've made, or just get away? I pride myself in being prepared for the worst, but this, this is truly a masterpiece. You should be proud. Anyway, what's my bracelet ID? 0913. it, apparently, when it's disabled. Given that they seem so powerful, that might be worth it. Go get the one down there. No? You don't want to move her or anything? Okay. It's cool. It's cool. Nah, I'm just going to chow down on a bunch of food. Let's make some stuff. I think at this point, yeah, I definitely need glue canisters. Why do people keep calling me? My god, give me a second. Just, ah. Uh. Back to you? Morgan? Oh man, thank god. I've just been going down the contact list hoping somebody would answer. I'm in trauma center. I came up here to look for supplies. I, I think I broke my arm when that blackout happened. Now I'm trapped. Aliens outside the door. I could really use some help, man. Damn. They're really dumping a lot of side quests on me. 
That's alright, that's fine. I was worried I was like right at the end game. I guess I'm not. Uh, good on that. Good on that. I'm guessing we need more. No, we don't need more of this, because I never use it. I've gathered up so much ammo. You know what I could do, though? I could make more weapon upgrade kits for it. What does that, that cost again? 3-3. Three, three. Well, I'm kind of running out of... I mean, I'm not running out of this, but this thing's getting kind of low. But I do have that upgrade that gives me more recycler stuff. So... I'll make a couple. I'll make three. Spend it all on my little zappy cannon. Yeah, the range is pitiful, so let's... Let's max that. Yeah, let's max it. And more shots. There's the bot coming down. So there's obviously no point in actually fighting them, right? Because they just keep spawning. So I think I'm just gonna run. Run or hide. So let's get to the lobby. Because from the lobby I can get to the trauma center and help that person out with a broken arm. And also... Does it want me to go down here? Oh shit. Oh. I don't know where it wants me to go, but I'm going to the lobby. Okay, let's help that person out at the trauma center first. So there are aliens outside the door. Breakfast is served in the cafeteria until 9 a.m. By aliens, do they mean military operators? Morgan! Hello, are you here for an appointment? Requesting new operator. I don't think I can move! Where the hell are they going? Hey! Where's the other one going? Hurry up, man! Why all the way over here? That was an operator ambush? I, I think it was more like an operator egress. Now this one's going down too, what is happening? You good in there? Oh god, there's more? confused about what the hell's going on. Doll's operators tricked me by impersonating a crew member and luring me to the trauma center. Oh! Survive the operator ambush. Well, I mean, I'm alive. 
They can't track me, so it's not like I need to do anything but just hide. Hello, nice to see you. Apparently, that was it? I mean, <laughs> they're still coming though, I don't know, it's just very arbitrary. So I have a certain number of attacks from them. I need to go up more to reach my office. Like, where's he even going? You know you can fly, right? Like, you could fly up here. Well, if you're gonna go that way, I'm going this way. See ya. Actually, this will take me to my office. Ah! Shit! Whew. Forgot about that. Hey, Igwe. There you are. Morgan. I was worried Dalo, his rescue team, had intercepted you. They are NCN9 black box operators, not a rescue team. Rescue is not among their list of commands. January, not now. Yes, of course. But Dal, his arrival may help us, as long as you have not killed him. You see, Dal is a recipient of several neuromods, a standard array of combat, tactics, interrogation mods. As I'm sure you know, your father, the board, is very thorough. Dr. Igwe, please present your conclusion to Morgan. Igwe, if there is a point. Ah, uh, well, yes. You see, Dull's mods are early C-series betas and vulnerable. As such, he has old-school thinking on some matters. If we remove them, he may forget his mission here. Yet we would still have access to the shuttle and a way home. Provided his piloting knowledge remains intact. It's a risk, but worth taking, I think. He'll have to be subdued, of course. I'm afraid that task falls to you. There is no one else alive on the station who can pilot the shuttle. It's worth a try. And there's been enough killing. Okay. So we're gonna make him forget, Morgan. what, years of stuff? Okay. It was an established process. Igwe, but you knew what was in Psychotrax. Ah! What was going on in Psychotrax? Anybody? Well, yes. They volunteered. Nobody? Volunteer? Okay. Ah! They didn't agree to be killed. They live on this illusion. Let's get a new friend. Balance their achievements, yet now they can do so much more. Much like parents passing along their experiences to their children. Are you serious? Have you ever. Do you even know what it means to have children, Igwe? Pardon me? What do you mean? I will do everything in my power to expose what you've done here, what you all did. Say another word, and I swear I will shoot you. Good job, Igwe. Luck finding a way up the station. All right. Well, I think it's a pretty good place to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, more people will call me. Hey, space I've pirate. I've been thinking about what you've done, what you're doing. We all must act according to our nature, no matter what the psychologists and priests say. And your nature, I think I was right before. You are like a rat, resourceful, sly, burdened with a kind of pestilence of the mind. 
This station was your laboratory, and the experiment was a failure. And, of course, sadly, you know what happens to the rats when they are no longer needed. I guess the space pirate's done with their soliloquy. So, hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, I'm gonna go incapacitate Doll. <laughs>